Easy RPM module. This box right here will basically take in any alternator noise from the vehicle to give us an RPM signal to our WinPEP 7 software. Um, we have Keith Locklear's Dodge truck here. Uh, basically, we're going to set it up and show you how it works. The first step in this process is either hooking it up with um, battery terminals with these alligator clamps, or you can go to, since it's up on this truck, we're going to go ahead and just go straight to the battery terminals on this truck. Go ahead and do ground to ground, power to power. After that, we're going to take the other end of this lead and connect it to the input portion of the module. Plug it in right here. Once we get that connected, there's a knob on here that 1 through 12. This is the number of cylinders that the truck has or car, whatever you're using. This truck is a six cylinder, so we're going to go ahead and turn the knob to number six. That's basically, now this will know every time it fires how to make it correct. After that, we can just go ahead and set this in any location. The next thing from here is we're going to go ahead and grab our secondary inductive pickup from our hardware stack, take it over to our easy RPM module, connect it to this U clamp at the end. Bam, and as you can see, we have a red flashing light coming from the truck as it idles, and we have an RPM signal on our WinPEP 7 software.